Hey, good morning, gang. Trash man here. A little chilly out there again this morning. Gotta keep bumming on it up here. Get cold, cold, cold. Gotta drink my coffee. <clears throat> uh, I gotta start off today good. You know why? Because after two months, I finally freaking got an unemployment check today. Woohoo! Woohoo! Yeah. Should have known when the wife was excited this morning. So, finally, that was a heck of a long out, drawn out process through all this pandemic or whatever the hell you want to call it, virus crap that cost me my dream job and everything. But, the other side of that coin, it wouldn't have been for that, you guys wouldn't be seeing me on most days. Project wise, I uh, worked my tail off yesterday. I did so much singing that the old man. Chest muscles and shoulder muscles here are a little sore this morning. I went to wholehearted uh, after it off on baby trunk. Uh, my uh, thoughts are I was going to use the aluminum flat bar and have to replace the old rod. It still would not work out. Uh, when I did my rough fits and back together, it's just uh, too thick. So uh, I ended up having to cut some sheet metal. So that took me a while yesterday. And uh, I spent well, I'll be showing you some stuff here, but let me show you what I got cooking, what my process is. Let me flip this old uh, lens around. All right. Here's what baby trunk's looking like right now. Not too shabby. We got some stain on the outer side of her. I started putting uh, the boards back on this morning. I put the boards on the lid and the boards back on the front here this morning. If you're wondering why she's not staying inside because baby trunk is going to get upholstery. So uh, that's how far I got. I finally got sand and sand and sand and you know, uh, should have stuck to my old rule of thumb but I got a little impatient yesterday. So I was talking about, you know, some of that wood filler here. Let me zoom in here because it just doesn't stain right. I mean, it is what it is. It's an old trunk and they're all old pieces and they're never going to be perfect. And if if you've done much studying or reading on most anything, uh, it'll always tell you just no different than me with the uh, chalk paint and not my cup of tea. Well, you know, I started in the 70s as a body man and a painter and everything had to be perfect. And there is no such thing uh, when you're doing this kind of stuff as perfect. Uh, there's no perfect grain. Uh, yeah, there's chunks of it that are absolutely beautiful and gorgeous and say, oh, I wish that grain like that would just cover the whole piece. Well, you know what? That's what makes it what it is. On my plate today, I want to get the, that going. I want to do the wax. It said wait 24 hours. Well, that was yesterday afternoon late, and I hadn't done it, so I'm going to be doing that today. We're going to do our first time doing our final wax on this uh, ABC chair. And I still got to figure out a hinge system on... Uh, Mary's desk here and I want to get that and I want to get that router today. Hopefully I'm going to at least get the hinge system in today. That's what I want to do. Then I got all these hardware parts to paint. And all these, believe it or not, yes, and those that originally, those didn't come off a of baby trunk, but I am baby trunk and I'm going to deck out baby trunk. Uh, Terry is allowing the old trash man here to embellish on his own instincts. Uh, bless his heart for having that kind of trust. So, you know, I got the paint work and stuff to do on uh, all this hardware. And then uh, I can get that part of baby trunk going and we got upholstery work to do on baby trunk. Uh, um, well, let me just stroll right on this way to shop and Ta-da! We have a new arrival. Well, Jeff messaged me yesterday, his wife Karen. And uh, Jeff and Karen brought this to me. Uh, she's a little rough. And we got a lot of peel work, you know. It was fun, fun, fun. Bottom board split. I'm going to have to check that out once I can get everything else off of it and see how bad it is and what we got to work with. She wants to keep her on the lighter side. Um, of course, she was mentioning the hinge piece and the bar goes in and holds that. Actually, I'm thinking about doing away with this piece entirely. I'll have to get a hold of Karen there and see if she's okay with that. 
and I'm just going with a handle here and get rid of get rid of this piece of course I have to take it out of the steel strapping and grinder and get rid of that piece and we'll bring most everything else back to life so we got another project here in the trash shop and that's what we like keeps us busy keeps us out of trouble right and then also about mostly the only human contact I have other than my family so uh, I'm going to get my butt to work Oops, I don't know if I can say that word I just said on YouTube. I hope I don't get in trouble for that one. My, my tushy to work. There's a little more appropriate, right? I don't know. But uh hope everybody has a great day. And I will see y'all soon. Peace out.